Hello everyone, I'm on my car now. This is 1996 Toyota Corolla. This model only has OBD1 diagnosis connector. After 1997, all um, Corolla um, include OBD2 or 10 uh, that uh, OBD2 port can support with OBD2 uh, scanner and you can easily uh, plug and read the uh, ABC ECU using that OBG2 scanner. In my case, we have, don't have any OBD support port and we only have OBD1 diagnosis connector. Uh, let's see how to check my ABS uh, warning light code using that OBD1 diagnosis connector. This is uh, you can easily find your OBD one diagnosis port in uh, right hand side of the engine bay. This is uh, your OBD one diagnosis port. You need to open that diagnosis port and you can see that some details in inside of that diagnosis port uh, you need to check if you need to check ABS warning light code you first need to remove this short pin now I remove my short pin you see carefully you want to remove this pin because of that can easily drop to your engine bay now I remove my short pin and I need to read this code this some of uh, some piece of wire or some copper wire what I need to uh, short two pins in this OBD one diagnosis port that two pin is TC and TC pin and E1 pin TC pin you can identify this section middle pin E1 pin is this nine section left bottom Pin. Now I showed that two pins using this piece of wire. I connect to the C pin and one pin. Now I move to the mic car inside and let's see how to check my ABS only light code. You can see my instrument panel and now I put my key ignition on position let's see how uh, how to read that ABS code after uh, I put in ignition cone on position ABS light uh, still flashing with some courses you need to read them uh, flashing and count and find out what would your ABS system so now I ignition on ABS light now you can see 
it's all some chords one pause one eleven that's code eleven one pause two that code twenty four that long pause now I record C plus one one that eleven one two three one two three four that's twenty four hello guys in the last section uh, you learn how to read ABS record using OBD1 diagnosis port uh, you remember I get my I get uh, two error codes uh, in my Toyota Corolla error code number 11 and error code number 24 in this section we uh, learn how, uh, what uh, what is the meaning of that error code and how to uh, identify um, the my uh, ABS uh, fault area. Uh, you see this is uh, you see in this computer screen. Uh, this is a chart of uh, ABS error code uh, meaning. Um, in the left column, uh, uh, you see uh, error code number. In second column. Uh, what uh, that error code mean in uh, last column you see, see troubleshooting area troubleshooting area mean uh, what area we need to check or identify this fault uh, I will uh, put a link in my description uh, uh, for you can easily access to the, this document uh, let's uh, identify the my error code problem in uh, first column you see the number uh, uh, this is a large number uh, your error code is uh, uh, is last two digit and in uh, first row uh, your error code is number 31 uh, 32 33 34 uh, you can easily identify uh, the error code in last two digit uh, my first error code is number 11 the number 11 error code meaning this open circuit in ABS solenoid relay circuit uh, that means um, ABS system has ABS uh, relay uh, in that area I need to check uh, to identify my problem yeah, in uh, troubleshooting area column um, um, you can see my troubleshooting area is ABS solenoid relay and ABS solenoid relay circuit I need to check those two uh, relay and relay circuit to identify this problem my second uh, error code is uh, number 24 uh, I can easily find number 24 in uh, first column that 24 error code meaning is open no short circuit in ABS actuator solenoid SRL circuit uh, my uh, second error code is 24 you can uh, uh, see uh, that meaning error code meaning in second column in the third column my troubleshooting area is brake actuator and SRLRs or SRL circuit uh, uh, in the last uh, section I mean uh, first part of this uh, video uh, you learn uh, in brake actuator and uh, other main component uh, if you not uh, watch that video I uh, put uh, link on my description uh, you can uh, uh, watch that video and get idea about uh, what is brake actuator in this uh, problem uh, error code I need to check my brake actuator and SL SRLR circuit and SRLH circuit uh, that is the um, idea of how to 
uh, identify your uh, error code then uh, what uh, find your uh, troubleshooting area if you're not subscribe uh, my channel yet i invite you subscribe my channel and get uh, the the uh, this uh, get like this valuable videos uh, in future uh, hope you this video help you pro find your abs problem and uh, get knowledge about abs your abs system uh, thanks for watching uh, please uh, remember to subscribe my channel okay bye bye have a nice day